Hey, what's up guys, it's Halt, and we're going to do a 103. I'll show you a couple tricks and tips and stuff like that. And then we'll deal with the Cadis, which is the worst. <laughs> I think it's the Cadis, actually, but uh, I'm not really sure what it is. But it's the motherfucker that you, you, everybody knows about. If you're watching this video, you've probably seen him in action, and you're probably like, that motherfucker. Alright, so, first of all, group up over here. So um, I'm sure there's f there's there are definitely faster ways to do this. I'm just showing you the easiest way to do this. Okay, so once he's triggered, all right. So there we go. Got him. Head over here. And all right, kill drone. Wait for them, and once they're near you, start moving up. It'll draft them because they're kind of going straight at you, and it'll give you uh, the better action where you don't have to keep starting and stopping because you're almost you're going in like a very low angled semicircle, I guess. All right, so don't let those guys get near you because they will shoot you as well. And you just don't get shot at all. All right, so most people at this point can or actually go here, trigger those drones, maybe take out a turret or two, uh, and then they take some decent damage because they're getting shot more than they need to. So what I do, the smarter route is coming this way. So once you've done that, head over here, and I think you see what I'm doing at this point. And like I said, this is not the fastest way to do this. This is the cheapest way to do this. The safest. Maybe not the cheapest, but definitely the safest. I don't know. Uh, better piloting, you might get something cheaper. I don't know. Alright, so again, you kind of start heading in that semicircle. Alright. And the last drone. So there we go. Perfect so far. So now we head back over here and take out the little drone carrier. And that will be the mostly the best. The hardest part of step one is already done. But I, I, I consider killing this uh, or killing all the drones and everything that's all sp this is all part of step one uh, you should never take that much damage from step one like you should almost take zero damage if you do it right Ooh, that's annoying they get that little bit of health left it's kind of like screw you <laughs> all right so, let's head down here. Don't get close to that scatter, even if you get it, because it, it literally will take like half your health away. Alright, so now that those drones are triggered, remember this is all same part of the same step process. You're basically just getting rid of the drones so they don't bother you anymore. Right, so what I love about this part is the retargeting kills those last two drones, and it's beautiful. Alright, so now, make sure he doesn't get close to you, because he will shoot. We're still doing pretty, ge pretty good, pretty good. Alright, so now we're actually going to sweep in from this side. And I will repeat myself, this is not the, the, si uh, the uh, fastest way. God, I can't even repeat myself, actually, apparently. Um, this is just the safest way to do this. So once you've done that, get over here, kill this little guy. And then you can kind of sweep in here, kill him. So that's all dead. So now we trigger these drones. So you're kind of doing the same crescent circle, but just down this way. All right keeps the drones all right 
and then two more. Well, that's the last of the drones. So let's kill these guys. Perfect. So we're doing really well right now, which means we're probably going to fuck up on the Cadis. Or the Cadis, or whatever you want to call it. Key keys. All right. Because it's key keys because Kick's eye is laughing at you. All right. Okay, kill that. I believe there's one more right there. But while we're waiting for him to get a little bit out, I'm just going to show you a little quick tidbit here that might help while you're waiting. So there we go, uh, right there. So they're stunned. You can actually take out these two missile turrets. Wow. There we go. And so that's all done. That's dead. I don't know what it actually does, but it's dead. All right, let's wait here. Make sure that doesn't like go too close to me. All right. I hate those things. It's just so hard. This game doesn't do depth perception very well. So like, I'm never sure when those things are in the air where the hell they're going. All right, so not quite. And boom goes the dynamite. He's dead. Now I am going to trigger him real quick. And then go t kill this turret here. Just because, you know, save some time. Alright, so now we're actually going to head over here. And um, so this part is a little bit tricky. And this is the most tricky part. So this is where you will take almost 100% of your damage. So you will kind of work on that uh, deflection on him as you're headed down this way. Okay, so that's good enough. So get down over here and wait for him. And uh, yeah, so this part you cannot rush. So you want as much ocean as possible. So I usually start right here. A little bit past that. So, let's do this again. And by again, I mean I've done so many of these damn 103s. Alright, so he's there now, so you're going to want to kind of keep on the edge of him. Like this. And you want to be right here. Except for I kind of messed up a little bit there and his drones got to me. Okay, so as he gets more damage, I think he actually uh, moves faster, but I'm not positive. But either way, so that is almost done. Don't mess up this last part. <laughs> God. All right. Ugh. This is the most stressful time of my life. There he goes. So there we go. So that's how you get rid of the Kades. Um And don't take too much damage. Obviously, I was, I did get hit a little bit. However, not bad enough. So before you head over there, go kill everything over here. I think this gives bonus damage. So let's just take it all out. I could be wrong. Um, but whatever it doesn't really matter because this isn't like you're running through any type of extra fire you gotta kill the thing anyway alright so let's head on over here head on over here alright let's see what this retargeting can kill alright let's kill this Alright, and there we go. The target is all done. I think that gives bonus damage to you as well, though, so it's up to you what you want to do with that. I can't remember what the whole post is. Kicks I posted about it, so if you want to find that, that'll give you the full details. 
But anyway, so that is a 103 with, uh, let's see, basically, let's head back to base, see if we got instant repair. So 10 seconds, 9 seconds, 6 seconds, 5, 4, 3, 2, and we are back at the base. So, that is, I believe, instant repair in my base, so let's try this. Unless one ship took more damage than the other, which is all possible, but it looks pretty good to me. Boom. Alright. Oop. Crap. Alright, so two minutes, so three minutes on the flagship, basically. All these useless ships that I still have. Three minutes on that ship, basically. Two minutes and twenty one seconds, still instant repair. Three minutes and forty four, so that one took the most damage. Assuming that this one did not, so that took the least damage. So yeah, so there we go. Instant repair in my base without using any crews. So that's pretty cool. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe for more tricks and stuff like that. Peace off, guys.